Mike got his uh, right. Big Up Strangers coffee. We are, of course, in Norwich. Hello, everybody. My voice is a little bit husky because I'm developing nodules. Mm -mm. Is it nodes or is it nodules? Something along those lines. Basically, I'm fucked up by this fucking door. It isn't wise. Hello, pretty green. We love you. Hi, Florentinas. It isn't wise to be playing an hour and 45 minutes and not warming up properly. So I am currently signing some of these official How Will I Know If Heaven Will Find Me posters. Let me show you what we've got here. Designed by Yornil. Um, who, I mean, this is so sick. He's got to do some stuff with us in the future, doesn't he? Right? It's just, he, we've got to do something with him in the future. Like some official stuff. Sienna Helen says, do you know Callum Bate? Do I know him? I get spanked by him every night on FIFA. Of course I know him. Hey, Slim Cat. Love you guys. Konnichiwa. Left-handed, no, that is, that is, uh, that's the fucking, um, that's the mirroring of iPhones, I'm afraid. What did you guys think of the fall? mosh pit in Glasgow? It was absolutely mental. Ciao, Shangri-La heritage, ciao. Uh, hey, Kimberly. Ooh, Geet Canny Music, Newcastle show. That was our favorite show we've ever done in Newcastle. That was our favorite show we've ever done in Glasgow as well. These are some of our favorite ever shows. It's just so such a celebratory. Come on, Tubbs. Um, such a celebratory feel to these shows. And I like that it's not all just like on the first album. Do you know someone called Sienna Helen? She's on our live. Oh, so. yes, my niece. How old? 12, Crap. Well, I just said that I do know Cal because he spanks me every night. <laughs> At FIFA. At FIFA. I put that in. Don't worry. Don't worry. Tell her. Tell her. She should be in school to get off. So. Uh, message from Cal. You should be in school, so get off the phone right now. Chris Bryant, what's the cover going to be for London? That's a great question. I don't know if there's going to be a cover um, this time. I'm losing my voice. Izzy Wizzy really wanted to go to your concert in Nottingham, but I'm old, not, not old enough. Dude, I've been there 100%. It's so frustrating. I'm really sorry about that. Uh, but your time will come. And you'll uh, make the most of it when it does. Jane Sween asks... How's Josh finding it touring here with you? Well, you can ask him yourself. <clears throat> I'd like to publicly say thank you to the Amazons for bringing me over here. I don't think anyone, any American has ever been given such a thorough tour of this godforsaken island mm. um, that you people call home. Mm -hmm. Now, I love it. This has been amazing. You guys, you guys make Americans look like, like children when it comes to music fandom. Bunch of fucking babies back home. Keep it up. Goo goo gaga to all my all all, all our American fans. Yeah. Bunch of babies back home. <laughs> uh, Por the rocks, indeed. Hey guys, looking forward to seeing you tomorrow night in London, hometown band and hometown fans, Woody and Speedy John. Hey dudes. Sienna says, can you say? Can you say that I said hi to Cam and Babe? He says, go back to school. He, sa he says hi as well. <laughs> Southampton was great, Ryan Neighbor, 23. Thank you. Anyway, so basically, um, <clears throat> Rob Gaunt, is Chris Alderton the best guitarist of all time? Because I certainly think so. Well, he's not even the best guitarist in the Amazons, mate. Um, these will be sold at shows. 
this is by an artist called Yonim. We did a special, very special edition of the album, um, which is now sold out. So the only place you can get this on your wall or in your wherever is at these shows, and they're going to be signed by us, which I am doing right now. Still missing Elliot's signature, but I'm sure. Oh no! Hang on, we're missing Joe's signature. What the hell was he doing? Where is he? Hmm. Michael Fisher, 99 pub after the gig tonight, lads. Absolutely not. I will be steaming. I will be steaming through my nostrils and my mouth, and it'll be coming out of my butthole. So, hey, oh, hi, Emily. Emily works for our label in the USA. They are wonderful people. Um, I retract everything I said about steam coming out of my butthole and everything about American fans. We love them very much and it's heartbreaking to disappoint them. But we will be coming back even stronger, even better, even sexier. We'll be hitting the gym and our flabby, skinny fat bodies will become rock hard. Just like our penises when we think of touring in America. <laughs> oh yeah shit um okay um okay S- saw you fellas live in Leeds my voice is still gone dude think about me singing every freaking night Flowery 18 howls Elliot sent him lots of love don't know haven't seen him all day and uh my day is a lot less stressful for it um Joe Chambers says you're going to get him banned, Matt. Well, ban me, all right? Fucking ban me. And that's it. That's 50 posters. 5-0, people. 50 posters. <laughs> Here we go. Aren't they beautiful? Aren't they beautiful? Also, Strangers Coffee. If you're in Norwich, Strangers Coffee, very good. Mm. Also, hey, we could do a little rundown of the rider. Uh, I I always ask for seventy percent chocolate. Cool. I don't know. I like it. What you got there, pal? Some chips. Chili heat wave. Chili heat wave, baby. Mm-hmm. This just papers over the cracks. Papers over the cracks. Right. This is funny. Right. Right. Okay. So, if you look at our fridge, it's like the band are like gamer nerds. Or like Venice Beach basic people. So, we got fuel. I don't have this. I don't, I don't do this at all. We've also got... This is terrible. We've got White Claw. (laughs) Ah, Jesus. Then this takes the piss. This, I cannot believe this is on a rider, but it is. (laughs) I'm not going to name names, but Chris Alderton needs, like, a couple of monsters and a couple of, um, and a couple of, uh, coffees a day to feel fucking real right let me tell you something that's revolution my li- revolutionized my life over the last few years oh no oh Barocca is always always good as well Barocca um Barocca this is I actually buy a shitload of these and when I go over to the states and I give them out as presents. Um, roasted pistachios, or in Italy, you say, pistachio. Um, Tabasco sauce, of course, very important. Um, and a little Chilean Malbec. A little, little, little Chilean Malbec. Chamomile teas, always incredible. And let me tell you my favorite thing. We don't have what? Tips. What, PG tips? 
No, I don't know. I don't think we have. We should ask for Yorkshire tea. I think that's the ultimate. Right. Mm. Dunya, come to California. Oh, okay. Wow. Wow. Classic Italian. It's not that we say pistachio. That's what it's called. Uh, this is revolutionized my life. What'd you do with the barrette? I... I don't know. Have we got ice? No. Oh, Jesus! Fucking... They bring ice later. No ice. No... Ice! <sighs> oh, here we go. Oh, wow, 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 wow. Here we go. Yorkshire, 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 Yorkshire. Yorkshire, 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 Yeah, you want my brand. Appreciate it. This is the single thing that has kept Keith Richards alive. For years. Barocca. Barack Obama. <laughs> Did you enjoy the Crown Posada in Newcastle, Cracking Boozer? Honestly, yes. And uh, the, the the barman was fantastic. We didn't understand the word they said. It was incredible. It's very, uh... I took a recording of that guy. Jacob, Jacob Wade, who's winning the World Cup? Argentina. Yeah, Argentina. It's their time. It's Messi's time. Mm. But also England, of course. All Brazil. Izzy Wizzy, how do you get one of those posters? Well, and you should ask that. We've got a show today in Norwich. Then we've got a show tomorrow in um, London. And these are the only places you can get the signed ones. If, 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 if there are some left, we will put them on our online store. We will put them on our online store. Callum, we listened to your drumming. Very fucking impressed, dude. It has just been one hell of a mad tour. Louis, or Lewis, could you... Thanks, guys. Um, are there songs that surprise you how well received they are? Yeah, Northern Star is just... This has turned into this moment every single night of the tour. It's, it's mental. It's been out for like been out barely a month and the whole crowd sings it at the end it's unbelievable um uh, yeah that one's a really exciting song don't be sure i say who drinks what well joe drinks the wine i drink the wine as well i just like birra morettis i just had the beers man uh, we drink a lot of tequila, actually. What I didn't show in the fridge was tequila. Um. Ooh. Le... Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, VN. Was incredible. We've got a pan fleet. Which brand of dark chocolate? Well, Kimberly, the brand of chocolate that we have right now is Lint. Lint Excellence. 70% cocoa lint. Where's lint from again? Manufactured in France, but it's but it's talk, but it's a whole the, the, it's like a Swiss Swiss brand, isn't it? Jacob Wade, if you weren't in a band, what occupation would it be? Um Ooh. Honestly, um I'd probably try and be something in music. I'd write music. No, sorry, not it. I'd be like a solo, like a writer or something, or, or honestly, like maybe a music journalist. So I get to listen to music and talk about music all day because that's all I do anyway. Probably a fraction of what I actually do is performing. And a fraction of what we do is making music. The rest is just fucking talking about it. Because <laughs> um, we're obsessed. Um, how can I, maybe I should, prescribe jobs for the other boys in the band if they weren't in the band. Chris is a very good graphic designer, so he'd probably do something around that. 
very artistic. Elliot would probably end up on an oil rig somewhere in the Atlantic Ocean. How can I found the guitar tabs of Black Magic? Well, I think Ultimate Guitar. Ben Harrison, do you remember going to school with my cousin Ellie Webb? Do I remember? Yes, of course. Phil Green Community School, class of 2005. Um, I remember IT class with Ellie Webb in year seven, so we'd be about 11 years old. And I was, neither of us were doing anything, we were both on the uh, uh, internet. She was looking at pictures of Reading FC players, Dave Kitson and Steve Sidwell, saying how gorgeous they were. And I was on like maggots.com because that was the Slipknot fan base. Everyone was like, we're maggots. And I was just on a Slipknot fan site just talking about Slipknot. And then I, I had this like semi successful YouTube channel where I would just rip all the videos of like footage from like um, like Slipknot recording stuff that I found on the fan site. And I just uploaded it to YouTube, which was like quite new at the time. I'd get fucking millions of views. And I would also upload covers of myself playing to like Metallica and things like that. Colin J ninety eight, could you DM us if you've already DM'd us? Apologies, please DM us again, and I will look into that. Ben Tungate, have you explored Norwich at all? Yes, we've seen about twenty of these strangers coffee places. I think I was I my my perception of uh, Norwich was completely skewed, and uh, I actually think it was fucking cool. L Lowell, Lowell, Lowell Records was. If you're 555, five, five, then I'm 666. Six, six. Planning to have a Nando's at Riverside before tonight's gig if you fancy some chicken. I personally don't eat chicken, but we actually have crew members who go to Nando's every single day. Every day. I look too good. Are you having a mad one after London? Yeah. Yeah. Time you on tonight? I think we've been on every night around eight forty-five. Uh, what tuning are you in for St Albans North Star? We are actually uh, in standard tuning, but live. My little vocal cords. We just whack it down at half a half a half a step to D sharp. All right. Well, this is getting boring now. So, as in, you're not boring. I'm boring. We're gonna sound check in a minute. It's, is it still four PM sound check? I think so, yeah. Have you seen anyone else? Has anyone come back? I think Joe's on the bus. Joe's on the bus. Yeah. Oh. I think so. Do you know what else is on the bus? FIFA. FIFA's on the bus. Who's your dream artist to collab with if you ever got the chance? Ooh, that's such a great question, because. With, like, the best artists that I absolutely love, I don't know, like, what I would be able to bring to the table that they haven't already got sorted. So, like, imagine sitting in a room with Bruce Springsteen or Paul McCartney. Uh, I don't know what I add to that. Hello, mate. Are you OK? You are right? Hello, boys. Just on live. Hello. Oh, hello. Keep buying our album, please. Thanks. Bye. Hello. We just went through the um, the fridge. Oh yeah. Yeah, people were really impressed actually. Yeah, they loved the they loved the white claw. They loved the tequila. They loved the monster. Everyone was like, it's for the gamers. It was the cool and the gamers that the gaming community on on the comments were like.
Yes. Matt, do you remember me and my wife met later Birmingham concert directly what? from Bologna? Yeah, I do remember. Fucking brilliant. Did you enjoy? Did you? Did you enjoy um, Norwich? Mm. They've got um, loads of. Just one sec, it's not my hair. Loads of, uh, loads of pigeon spies here. Did you? I did. Yeah, great. <laughs> great. Yeah. Hundreds of pigeon spies there everywhere. What, birds aren't real, right? Yeah. No, oh, no, my no, God. Did no, you see? No chance. No chance. You all right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're on live. You're on live. Come back. Come back. <laughs> Fuck. So guys, I tried to uh Oh, hey, that looks all right. Yeah. What the hell are those? Uh, windows? Fuck. Ah, oh, it's really cute. That's right. I like it. I Hey, 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 hey. You're on live. Hey, hey, live. Hey, live. Hey, live. Hey, live. Why, peeps? Are we on the live? The Tessay 97, why the venue change? Um, the fucking pandemic, bruv. That's why the venue change. Um, Matt got smoked. Uh, oh, wow. Go suck yourself off. Um, <laughs> is Chris back with the pigeons? Yep, loves them. Right, so, the interviews continue. Hello, could you um, give us interviews? your name? Yeah, give us your name and occupation and your relationship to the band. The Earl of Croydon, the Earl of Croydon, aka Croydonier, aka Mix, Mix Master Mike, aka uh, aka the Wood House. Nice, aka. What was your bowling name last night? Uh, the Earl, actually. Yeah, nice. I was the Earl. And what do you do? Um, I am front of house engineer mm-hmm. for the Amazons. I take these things microphones and I make them really really loud and uh, deafen everyone that's basically the plan that's what we go for it right yeah that's what we're going so. for especially yeah. with the the eardrums of uh, no, of Norris tonight oh, uh, yeah. um, so, okay so ooh Rob Gaunt where he was on Catfish's tour oh, oh. well well uh, <laughs> that's good well remembered that's good famous well not anymore oh, um, so uh, we, we got we got <laughs> <laughs> we got we got Calvate here. Um, what do you do, Calvate? Uh, I am an audio advisor for the Amazons. Mm-hmm. Um, that's it. And where do you stand in relation um, to us on the stage? I I, I look at their um, butts from um, there all day. What do you think butts. is the biggest challenge for you? Oh, um, more of an emotional um, support system on stage. Um, yeah, and and that's it. Really, I just get to look at some, you know. Nice people all day. I just stare at the back of their heads. That's it, really. And beat Matt of FIFA a lot. Oh, yeah, a lot of FIFA. I have FIFA myself. Now, Toby. Yeah. It's time for your interview. What do you like? What What do you What do you like? What do I like? What do you What do you do? Uh, what's your name and what's your uh, occupation with the band? Uh, my name is Toby, mm-hmm. and I look after drums and playback. You set all that up. I set all that up. And that the laptop. And that. So, um, basically, yeah. uh, I, I guess the, the biggest change with the Amazons live now, yeah. um, as opposed to when you've seen us before, is uh, just a fraction of what you see on stage is actually being performed live. Yeah, about... Yeah. 10%? 10%. So, really, I don't sing that much anymore. Um, can't be bothered. And all these amps, yeah. they're actually fake. They're not real. Not all not all of them, but that most of them. Two, that one's real. This one's real. definitely real. Most of it's fake, actually. Um, this one's real. Joe's actually not here. He's actually got a lookalike the on stage. The only real thing out of the entire set. With the Abba Voyage tour. Someone just said, Toby plays cowbell. He does. Yeah, he does. Someone well, just said, Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Toby, um, also, biggest challenge for Toby is hiding. Yeah, one of that. Oh, oh. It's gone. Oh, how was that? Uh, what's the coolest guitar that we have? Oh, that's an easy. That's an easy. 
That is an easy, 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 easy question to answer. It is this. The flying V. From Gibson. Thank you, Gibson. Joshua Spears plays that one. Um, he lost a bet, and now he plays the fucking fine V. Um, all right. This has been fun. See ya. Bye. Bye. Everyone says bye. Bye, bye. bye, bye. bye, bye. I don't believe Joshua Spears has been to the pub at all. Unfortunately. I'm, I'm just going to chuck him on up. There. Josh Spears, have you been to the pub at all? No. I'm ready. No. no. Well, it's probably for the best. No, you don't. All right, so... Callum, mm-hmm. um, who are you and what do you do for the band? Um, I'm Callum, I'm the tour manager, mm-hmm. um, and I essentially make sure that the show is, goes well and everything's planned and we do everything as we should do. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, you do a good job. Oh, oh hang on. And we've got a newcomer. <coughs> Name? Sam. Hello. What do you do? Um, I take photos. Nice. And you're on WhatsApp. Fantastic. I'm on WhatsApp too. Oh, that's great. Fantastic. Just showing everyone the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> I won't save it. I won't save it. It's fine. Well, maybe I will. There was a good little bit of me running after Elliot. Yeah, that was great. That was good. Did you see it on the live? Did you watch it on the live? We saw it. Did it look good? We saw it. Though. Yeah, I know, but I wanted to see if it translated. Yeah, sure um, Joe, you've got some... <laughs> you've got some wonderful posters to... Sign. Sign. They're really nice. Okay. Yeah. They're really, really... Nice. All right. I think this is a good... The in, in or out? Obviously in. Jesus. Um, all right, feel like that's it. Yeah. Oh, one of the good, one of the questions we had today, we were discussing today, boys. One of the questions we had today, what's the greatest American band? Man. Greatest, the best, the greatest, biggest, best American band. Handsome. Uh, Handsome. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I played a show with the fourth Hanson brother recently. Okay. Well, did he make it? Exactly. <laughs> I remember talking to him in the dressing room. I was like, I was like, Legendary. See you, like, you've been a music girl life. He's like, nah, I'm going to back then. Okay, like, see really you, Legends. Cool. Wait. Oh, like, really Red Hot Chili Peppers. Yeah. It's really good. 